everyone is doing well so in this video I'm going to show you guys how to do a deep dental cleaning at home so the reason why I'm doing this video is because we're in this pandemic and you may not be able to afford to go to the dentist or maybe your dentist is closed maybe they're not accepting any new patients it could be so many cases right now because of this pandemic so I definitely want to bring this to you guys so anyway one thing I do want to say really quick is that this practice does not replace your dental visits okay you should go to the dentist at least every six months to make sure you get that deep clean get those x-rays okay because the dentist can see things that you cannot see such as deep cavities and also the dental hygienist can clean areas that you just simply cannot get to so yeah guys in this video i'm going to show you how to basically have a dental spa at home you're going to be feeling so fresh and so clean <laughs> now it's time for me to show you the products really quick and then i'm going to do everything so the first thing i have here is my dental kit i actually got this from dollar tree for only one dollar so i'm going to use this device right here to actually clean my teeth and I'm going to use the tongue scraper right here to clean my tongue I found this bad boy at Dollar Tree and I just wanted to try something different of course you don't need to have this product you just need to have a very good um, you know toothpaste that you prefer to use so anyways I have this the next product I have here is my handy dandy dental floss all right, so I like to use a electric toothbrush, so I'm going to use this handy dandy right here. <laughs> As you guys can see, my baking soda box look a little rusty, but it's all good in the inside, you know. <laughs> so these are my two favorite products. So I'm going to use the baking soda and the hydrogen peroxide to clean my tongue. All right, guys, last but not least, I'm going to do a warm salt water rinse, and that would just finish it off. Right, guys so the first thing we're going to do we're going to remove tartar from our teeth now we're not going to scrub or scrape our enamel what we're going to do is actually scrub or scrape our tartar that's very important you do not want to damage your natural teeth your natural enamel okay so I'm going to show you guys how I do that I don't have that much tartar on my teeth I don't have that much buildup so I may have to demonstrate with oatmeal on my teeth so let's see what it looks like with my natural teeth with nothing added on there let's see if i got anything not much you can't really see so i'm going to go ahead and put some oatmeal on my teeth so that way i can show you guys how to do this because i don't really have much tartar build up on my teeth it's kind of bright in my room so it's kind of hard to see so hopefully you guys could you know get the idea so if you use this in or this in i like to use this in so i'm just gonna just you see there you go okay do that again you can even see my gum lines are bleeding a little bit that's good getting getting you know stuff that shouldn't be there out see that grossy gross 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 so like I said you do not want to scrape your actual teeth you're just scraping off the tartar on your teeth okay and you're doing this like right under the gum line that's usually where the tartar lives so it's right under the gum line that you're scraping under Got some blood right there. 
under the gum line. Look at that. Got some stuff. Can you see that? I got some stuff under there. Gross, right? Underneath the gum line. Look at that. It's oatmeal, but still, I have some stuff in there as well. I'm human, you know? So, yeah. Look at that. All right here is blood. You see that? It's a deep cleaning. You're going deeper than what your toothbrush can do. So you're going to <laughs> So you're going to bleed, okay? There's no more. I'm literally bleeding right now. Look at that. All right guys, so now it's time for me to floss, okay? So all I do is just wrap the floss around these two fingers like this, and then I will slide the floss between my gum line, and then I will curve it underneath my gum line, and do this little motion right here, and then slide it to the other side, do the same thing, and then pull it out, okay? So that's what I do. And I might bleed a little bit, only because I just did a deep, you know, scraping of my um, tartar. So anyways, let's do this. Okay. And you can see some debris right here. Okay. 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 And if your floss is like kind of bloody, you could change the floss. Obviously, you definitely want to do that. Right, guys so we floss our teeth now we're going to go ahead and brush our tongue so I have a bowl here and I'm just going to add a little bit of baking soda okay so I have some baking soda in here and now I'm going to add a little bit of hydrogen peroxide um, the baking soda and my hydrogen peroxide mix is my favorite thing to do when it comes to my oral hygiene so a little bit just a little bit there i'm gonna add a little bit of white toothpaste in here 
Do not allow the baking soda mix to touch your skin because it will cause dry white patches around your mouth. I'm going to go ahead and scrape my tongue as well because like I said, this is like a deep cleaning, okay? So we're gonna do everything, all right? All right, guys, since we wanna do a deep clean, we're gonna go ahead and brush our tongue one more time, okay? This is a deep clean, you know what I'm saying? Like, you're gonna be feeling fresh when you're done. You hear me? Fresh. So we're done with the tongue cleaning, scraping, whatever you wanna call it, and your tongue should look like this. A nice and pink, and if your tongue don't look like this, nice and pink then you should do it again all right guys so now i'm going to go ahead and brush my teeth okay so now it's time for me to brush my teeth all right with my charcoal toothpaste okay <laughs> so i'm just gonna put a good amount on here there we go mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> all right so here we go One thing I want you guys to keep note of is that when I brush my teeth, I actually have my mouth slightly open instead of having my mouth closed together. That way when I brush my teeth, I could clean the whole surface of my teeth. Cleaning your gum line is very important, especially as you get older. <laughs> now pay attention to the direction I'm going. I'm going towards my gum line versus away from my gum line, so that way I do not cause receding gums. Don't forget to brush inside of your cheeks, the roots of your mouth, and under your tongue. Alright guys, so we're on the last step and that's just to rinse our mouth. Now if you want to do this on your kids, you actually can. Just be a little gentle. Now with this last step, I say use some fluoride rinse on your babies. Um, of course not infants, not infants. So anyways, yeah, use some um, a fluoride rinse instead of this, okay? So this is um, an anti-cavity rinse. Um, this is for kids. Basically, it says for age, adults and children six years of age and older, they can use this every single day after brushing their teeth and this helps prevent cavities. This is really good. It's basically a fluoride rinse. So yeah, so age six and older per instructions, all right? One last thing, make sure your kids do not swallow this. It's good for the teeth, but not good for the gut, okay? So no swallowing at all. <laughs> okay, this is some warm water, okay? From the sink, just put it on warm. And then I'm gonna add my salt in here. Salt water is just a natural way to help get rid of bacteria, so I love this. So here we go. Cheers, guys. Cheers to a great smile. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, since this is deep clean day, let's do it one more time. <laughs> Video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love making videos like this 
if you like videos like this definitely subscribe definitely hit the notification bell so when your girl pop through you're like there she is so i'm super excited for you guys to try this whole routine out try it out and let me know how you feel i guarantee it when you get back to your dentist your hygienist they're gonna be like you done a good job what what did you do <laughs> so anyways yeah guys that's it i'm gonna show you guys my smile and that's the end of this video so this is my smile i'm so excited and i love it my teeth look so clean and so white and my gums are not bleeding anymore so yeah <laughs> i love it <laughs> Alright guys, that's the end of this video. I hope you like and I hope you enjoy. Share this video. Don't never tell somebody that their breath smells bad. Just share this video. <laughs> Alright guys, bye! <laughs>